everyone. Welcome back to another match day vlog. It's a midweek game. Uh, it's the first round of the cup. And we're going to the last game of today, which is the Silesian Derby. It's the Slonsky Classic between Gekke Skatevice and Gornik Jobja. Both teams and fans are friends of each other, so we're not expecting any dangerous stuff. But I am hoping at least for a good match. Uh, last year, actually, the bo both teams played against each other also in the cup. Uh, Gornik won that one after going down 1-0. And then Lukas Bodolski scored two goals to win it for them and send them to the next round. Both teams are from uh, last in the weekend. Uh, we saw Gornik lose against Legia away and uh, GKS lost against Gdansk away. But they lost more against the referee than actually against Gdansk because that referee was just horrible. And that's how relaxed the atmosphere is. Like, jobs of players are just stepping out of the bus in front of us. Uh, remember, I never did a beer review here. Uh, it's Okuchim, 12 Zlotis. It's good. So, a little football trivia fact. Uh, in 1994, on this field here on Bukova, Gekas played against Bordeaux in, in European competition. And on the field was a French attacking midfielder, 22 years old, with a number seven, and who would later become one of the best footballers in the world. And Gekas actually won that match also.
next day. So quick review before I go back to work. Did Gekas deserve to win? No. Did they deserve to concede four goals? No. Did Gornik play well? No. In short, the match went like this. Uh, Gekas controlled most of the ball during the game, but they didn't create any dangerous chances. Gornik, with their little moments of possession, did. At halftime, they went to the dressing room with a 2-0 lead because of that. Second half, Gekas was attacking again most of the time, and which left their defense like far away from the goal. And Gornik took advantage of that with two counters and two goals. And yeah, that was it actually. Atmosphere was great from both sides. Cool pyros. But yeah, Gekas is again eliminated from the cup by Gornik. Yeah, we'll see who Gornik will get in the next round. And maybe we'll go there. But yeah, that was a quick review. Quick uh, midweek game. And we'll be back on Saturday. So please subscribe, like, comment. You know what to do. And we'll see each other in the weekend. Bye-bye.